What's up everyone? Today we have this new unboxing of this Stearman PT-17. It's a Revel kit. I picked this kit up a few weeks ago. Just now I made it around to give an unboxing of it. This is an old World War II trainer biplane. And uh, this, this plane has a lot of history behind it. It's pretty cool. I've never unboxed a plane or built a model plane, but this is my first one. I'm starting to get more into like the military type stuff and yeah so I think this plane is a great beginner to it. Here's a short piece of history of the Stearman PT-17. The Stearman PT-17 also known as the Boeing Model 75 was built in the 1930s. During World War II the Stearman was the primary trainer for pilots. Over 8,500 aircraft were built to train and prepare pilots for combat. After the war the Stearman were used for many different jobs, including crop dusting and aerobatics. So let's get more into unboxing of it. Here's the Army version, there's a Navy version. The kit is six inches long. The wingspan is eight inches. There's 59 parts. It's molded in light gray. Here's like the brief history on the about the plane. In real life, the plane was 24 feet long. It had a wingspan of 32 feet. It had a seven-cylinder radial engine, and it had 220 horsepower. And the max speed was 124 miles per hour. So let's get right into the unboxing of it. So yeah, let's remove the top. The first thing you see. We got the first package. We got the second. It looks to be the wings. Got the first package. We got a fourth package. Looks to be the fuselage. We got the clear parts and glass. It looks like. And we have the instructions. Instruct inside instructions or the decals. Here's the instruction pack. First page and tells you the paint guide over here. Tells you the paint guide. Tells you all the parts on this page. It begins in step one. It's a quick skim. There's 11 pages and 13 steps. Oh my bad, 14 steps. All right, we've got the first package open. Looks to be the stabilizer. And for, I'm sorry if I get some of these parts wrong. I'm not really familiar with airplanes. We got the engine, very detailed. All these parts are very detailed. They're really great, like the plastic sturdy. Not flimsy. Looks like we got the firewall, pieces of the fuselage. Looks to be we got some struts. Looks like for the landing gear. We got a propeller. Next bag. Here we got, looks like a bottom of the fuselage, the rudder, looks to be like the other side of the fuselage to the top. And the next package, we have, looks like the wings. There's another part of the wings. 
and those things. We got another package. Looks like we got the tires. I don't know a lot of these parts. I'm just looking to see what I can point out. Like instrument instrument panels. Looks like we have an oil tank, part of the fuselage. We have part of the frame sides right here, right here. Part of the firewall. There's all kinds of details on this. Revel always does a great job, and there's no no flashing as I see as at this point. I don't see none of these parts. Looks like there's very little cleanup around the edges. Looks like they molded is in great. They mold it great. There is also this clear parts. I am not going to take it out of the package because it gets get scratched up. But you can see that decals. Got the army. Got looks like the wood for the propeller. Got all different sorts of stuff. Instrument panels. I don't know if you can, there we go. Lift jack. So there's some tiny, tiny stuff. I can't even really see this. But this should be a fun build, interesting build for me. I have never built a airplane, so it should be fun. I am getting more into like the military stuff. I found that stuff really interesting. And I will be building this. And this is just a little unboxing of it. And yeah, so if you like to see more stuff like this, stick around to my channel. I did a lot of cool stuff which I think it's cool. <laughs> you know, he's like a new modeler, just learning, and you guys are watching me learn, which is really cool. Like, so you guys are following me, really watching me learn all of this. And I have actually learned a lot from the first video I ever made to now, I've learned quite a, quite a lot. And like, I feel like my skills are getting a little bit better. Um, sometimes they really don't show on camera, but I think they are getting better. There is 10 sprues all together. It looks very interesting, really detailed. So, if you guys like this, give me a thumbs up. If you comment what your favorite kit is, and are you into like military, automobiles, tanks, armor stuff? So, let me know what you're into.